first day run, this time for Class Single A, where we have another top seed in Southridge. The Panthers are 22-4 and four on the season and are headed back to state, and they look to break their curse and get past the first round. Last week, Southridge put their team's resiliency on full display when they needed two wins over Cherry. They claimed game one and kept game two exciting, giving up three runs in the bottom of the seventh to tie things up, force extras, but broke the tie in the eighth to earn their ticket to state. We spoke to head coach Aaron Weber earlier today, and he said between their eight seniors, six returners to the starting lineup, and their team's depth chart, he's confident that this year's outcome at state will be different than years past. This isn't the most talented team we've had, um, but this is the best. Uh, our best batting average, best fielding percentage, best pitching staff. Um, and it's not because of talent, it's because we have a good group of seniors and a few juniors that are really good leaders for these guys. They should have confidence. They've earned it. Um, you know, I'll tell you guys tonight, they're the one seed for a reason. You know, with that being said, we've battled through a lot this year, we've battled through injuries, battled through really, really tough losses. And then, um, you know, here we are, and uh, I think this is our year. First pitch in the Class A quarterfinals is set for tomorrow at 3.30 in St. Cloud against random draw, Belgrade, Brutonel Rosa. And